magnificent North Saskatchewan River Valley will become even more accessible once the River Valley Alliance plan is completed. The first phase commits $90 million to improving public access, building new trails, docks, and other features. It's already North America's longest metropolitan park system. The River Valley Alliance is an alliance of seven municipalities in the capital region that have land bordering the North Saskatchewan River. We're hoping that this is something that the generations ahead will enjoy as additional recreational opportunities in our River Valley. Of that 90 million, the City of Edmonton is actually getting 72.9 million. And what it is, is it's really money for projects about accessibility. It's about getting people into the River Valley. It's about giving them destinations in the River Valley. The plan also includes counties of Devon, Parkland, Strathcona, Fort Saskatchewan, Leduc, and Sturgeon. In its ultimate form, the overall cost is projected to be $600 million over 10 to 20 years of development. Up until 2012, a huge part of it was also creating the plan. And it took many years to create a plan that covered the 88 kilometers of the river valley and identified where the trails, where the bridges, where the boat launches should go. In its ultimate form, the River Valley Alliance Trail and Valley System will begin right here in Devon by the bridge near this spectacular cut bank, work its way up through the Devonian Gardens, then to Edmonton, and then north through Fort Saskatchewan. About two and a half kilometers of trail in Strathcona County, and more trails near Fort Saskatchewan, particularly in the Sturgeon County side, uh, approximately six million dollars of our project is intended to be spent building trails in the Sturgeon County area across from Fort Saskatchewan. We're also adding a new pedestrian bridge which gives us access from one river terrace to another river terrace. We're also doing a whole series of uh, docks and launches so we're not just talking about access to trails we're also talking about access to the water and to the river. For example a dock at Terwilliger Park mm. and in fact, Terwilliger Park is the location of one of our larger projects, uh, a footbridge connecting Terwilliger Park to the Centennial Lands. Also within Edmonton is the concept of a valley pedestrian lift or escalator near downtown, plus 25 kilometers of new trails. Still urging public input into this, the initial phase of this long-term project occurs over the next three years. We have a whole consultation process that we want to undertake for all of these projects. So there will be opportunities for the public to have input into all of this. We've got the plan, we've got some of the funds, we're ready now to start building. This is Tim Dancy.